Hello, everybody. This is going to be a DIY indoor TV antenna. And let me tell you something. This antenna right here that I'm fit to show you, it's going to be the absolute best indoor TV antenna that you can get. You can't, you ain't even going to be able to buy one that's going to be better than what I'm fit to show you. I throwed one together and I tested it and made sure it was alright because I don't want to have to disable my comments from showing you no messed up bull. You know what I mean? Alright, now here's what I got. I cut a piece of copper uh, 49 inches long. We actually need 48, but I cut it 49. And some of y'all seen me do this. I'm going to put this in the vise. And here's how I straighten my wire. All right, I got the drill. I'm going to stick a drill in the end of it. Now, now listen, y'all. I didn't do it much, but I done done this step. Just my camera wasn't working a while ago, so that's why. But it only takes, like, probably three seconds to straighten it. When you get it straight, stop. Don't. Don't sit there and keep on, because the more you do it, the weaker it'll get. All right? And uh, here's what I'm going to do. I got my yard stick out here, and, you know, I told you I done done this right here. Mark every seven, uh, every six inches all the way down, and you should have about like an inch left over or something like that. All right, my camera wasn't filming again. I I went to my first mark and I bent this into a square, and then I'm going to uh, go behind this line. This is important, you know, to go behind the line because I want my black spot to be the corner, and I'm gonna bend another square back. And y'all, I got a lot to tell you, a lot to tell you. I put up antennas for a living. I make and put them up. I make a thousand dollars a week putting up antennas. And I've got a real big channel with a hundred antenna videos on there. And I might have, I, let me just say this. I work two or three days a week and make a thousand dollars a week. And everything that's on that big antenna channel I got, which is Danny S. Hodges, I'll show you a little piece of that. It, it'll it teach you everything you need to know on how to do it. Now, I could make more if I wanted to, but I'm already doing more than I even want to do now. See me, now I'm, I'm bending this and back the other way. Now don't go to thinking that thing ain't nothing. Son, I'm going to put the whammy on this thing because uh, I'm going to do more than just this. I'm going to be in this back. You see where I'm going, don't you? And then I'm going to uh, be in this this way. And I got an antenna that's called the ultimate antenna that's famous I, I get, man I get a bunch of views a day a bunch I promise you a bunch alright see how see that and then the, and see there's my long piece right there and uh alright I got this in the vise and see uh I got my Six inch mark right here somewhere. Let me find it. I'm gonna cut it. I'm gonna cut it on a six inch mark. Cut my extra off. And, and here's something I'm gonna do. And I got some more stuff to tell y'all. And some more stuff. And some stuff to show y'all. Get that cigarette out of my mouth. Look here. What I'm saying about this, what I'm doing, is you can do it too. I got a bunch of people that's that started doing this from looking at my 
you know, that hundred channel, that hundred video channel. And I explain everything, you know, like a good beginner, because most of you are, you know. But anyway, I got friends on Facebook. That's from YouTube. That them son of a guns. They putting videos on their channel. The same the same exact one I showed them how to make. And they and people's going on and on about how smart they are. Them jokers ain't even saying that they learned it from me. <laughs> and I mean, I just kind of go along with it, you know. I'm going to solder this together. And something I want to do. I want to try to get my solder hanging down a little bit, you know. Like at the bottom, you know, just for strength. Okay, yeah. I got it there then. Let me show you this. And, I, and son, this is going to be a bad joker now. See this right here? Let me tell you. This right here will pick up UA, uh, V8, let's say UHF good. It'll pick up UHF good. But I'm going to add something to it that will make it pick up a VHF good. Now here's that uh, ultimate antenna I was talking about. It ain't got reflector on it, but... That antenna right there is famous. And then I got this hybrid antenna. You know, and all these I'm fitting to show you is on my channel. You know that uh, when you sit there and write a song, you know when somebody's singing your words, you know. And I asked a man on YouTube, I said, I said, uh, where'd, you, where'd you learn how to make that antenna? Because they ain't none. I come up with the measurements, everything. This, and it was this one right here. I come up with all the measurements and everything. He said, I rode around the neighborhood and seen it. Okay, I had to go ahead a little ways, y'all. All the days, I'm not going by one. All the instructions is in my head. There's only one of these right now, and it's this one right here. But you can get these right here at Home Depot. They three quarter inch tees. And how I join them together is, you know, there's a little one inch uh, three quarter pipe inside of here. And uh, I, I reckon I could have showed you how to make that, but uh, I don't think it's necessary. But mine was already made. All right, I got this in the vise. And I got my... This is probably about an inch apart. There's some stuff that matters, and there's some stuff that don't matter. But uh, here's what I'm going to do. Now, I got me some epoxy here. You can use anything you want to. You can not have to use nothing if you don't want to. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to wipe a little bit of this on there just because I don't want it moving around. Because we got to, you know, once we get it clamped and everything, we got to straighten it. You see this right here? I'm going to, this is half inch or something. And I'm going to put this inside there just to give more to tighten to. Okay, you see these stainless steel washers? I bent the edge. I put it in a vise and bent it over with a hammer. Okay, because I kind of was fooling with this, and uh, it wasn't going to act real good, you know, because you got to be where you can straighten it out. All uh, right, let's see. Here's my screws. I'm going to tell you all something. You know, I was talking about the dude making the antennas, like ones like mine. I seen him make a crucial mistake that, he don't know no better about it. Y'all, I've done this stuff right here. I've tested and tested and tested. And 
And they, they, they is little stuff that matters. Damn, I forgot to put my washers on. All right, let me back that out. Some of the stuff you do don't matter, and some of it does matter. And I'm somebody I really ain't no fast learner or nothing like that. I might, people think I am, but I just study hard, you know. All right, I'm going to sit this back up straight. And, you know, you're supposed to be at having, you're supposed to be doing this and enjoying yourself. But, and I did at first. I only got me two transformers. Now, reckon why I got two. <laughs> All right, now I got to slip these in, and while I'm doing this, I want to tell y'all something. I'll put it this direction. I do it left-handed. Boosters. You think all boosters is the same? You you heard that before about what you heard them talking about a booster. Don't boost the signal strength. That's bull. You know, that's like if you take your race car to somebody and they're going to hop it up for you and they say, oh, it don't help the speed, but it's in there. <clears throat> I've tested all kind of boosters uh, because I don't have nobody telling me nothing. And, uh, Hell, I had to know. You can't read and find out about it. The boosters I use, son, they will make that signal meter go up. I, uh, the booster that, that I'm going to put on here, the booster I'm going to put on here makes, that, makes the meter go up. Now, me and myself, I want to see the signal strength go up. And see, this is the reason I kind of put this down as good as I can so you can adjust it out. And it was pretty straight. But, uh, and now let's move on. I got to hurry up, y'all. But let me show you this right here. This is a T2. And like I say, these pieces was already made. I already had them. And I didn't have no extra, but... You might want to use the elbow right here instead of, I cut that off, see. And let me tell you something. There ain't no magic number right here. I have got this. Look at that off center a little bit. See what I'm talking about? Got to move it around. Now, now this is probably, uh, probably an inch and a half. Let me move this a little bit more. Okay, but see these these is 14 and a half inches long. And what I'm gonna be using is 14 inch pieces. And let me tell you, I can't remember where I got this measurement from. But it ain't just a night of the blue measurement. It's a measurement that works like a dream. You can do just this part I'm talking about right here, and don't even mess with that. And this is a uh, this is a VHF picking up some of a gun, boy. I, I actually got a video about that, you know. Okay, and and what I'm gonna do is I'm going in there and adding and and putting this on there on both of them. All right, I'm gonna put I'm gonna put some uh, epoxy on this. Your YouTube reputation is important. There's people that go in there, man. They watch every video I got, and let me tell you something. It might be a surprise to you. 
There's people that will make videos just for the money. I ain't one of them, bro. You know, and that goes back to reputation, you know. If you see somebody do one thing wrong or lie to you, they won't get a second chance to lie to you. All right, I'm putting a piece in this and two. There is one other thing that I want to say. I, I do still enjoy making antennas. It's the feminine that I hate. Because, man, I mean, it's a pain, you know. Now, I have people sometimes, you know, I have people leave crazy comments and stuff. But I have people talking about spray painting the wire. <laughs> <laughs> And man, I'm trying to sit here and figure out are they for real or not. <laughs> hey, I'm telling you, when I get through with this thing right here, it's going to be a bad boy, I promise you. Okay, can you see this okay? And what I've done is, here's my bottom. I put a T on that and then I split it in half. And you get your board or whatever you want to, you know, whatever you want to be your base. And set this on there. And boy, I got so much that I couldn't tell y'all. I do want to tell this right here. I ain't never, I ain't never told it before. When I was making them ultimate antennas in the beginning, I messed around there and found out how to make the power go up on it. The signal meter and I was using the Channel Master 777 the most powerful booster they make hey it was working fine I put that booster on there and that booster was too much candy for that antenna so I had to drop back down it took me a week to figure out what's wrong I had to drop back down to the 777. I want to make sure you understand that booster was a 778 I had to drop back to. Uh, and I actually was, do was doing all kind of talking. And the camera wasn't on again. That's what I tell you, man. This stuff's aggravating. This reflector right here will double the signal strength of this antenna. That big channel I was talking about, I got videos showing you demonstrations of, of how powerful this is. Okay. Now, I didn't just tell you that while I go about the booster for the hell of it. If you live right in the city, you may not need this. Now, this is an RCA booster, and I use this one right here a lot. But they make something, I don't even know what you call it, you have to check on it. That'll connect the VHF with the UHF down here and convert into one wire. If you need the booster, one of these is UHF, one of them is VHF, and you connect your wires like that, and they just I got a video on this. On this channel. It that video is on this channel. And uh, I'm going to put my booster right here. Hey, y'all, I'm finished. This antenna right here is a stick of dynamite, son. You're looking at a stick of dynamite. You're liable to see the manufacturers make an antenna like this right here. This is the only one in existence. The one like I got and the one you're going to build. Let me turn it around. I got it jammed in there pretty tight. Look at this. You know, straighten up your straighten up your elements and get them right. Well, oh, I see what it is. Like I say, son, that right there is a stick of dynamite. That's a bad boy right there. I didn't get to say everything I wanted to say. I want to tell y'all, this took me two days because I was filming. I could have I done this in probably an hour, 
I'm good at it. I make, <laughs> I make them all the time. You might want to subscribe to me. There's a lot of stuff that I tell. I do want to tell you, I want you to, if you like this video, I want you to click like, YouTube like, for you to let them know they, that you like something. And I'm going to do a test on this antenna. I'm going to set it out in the front yard. I, I can't put it in my house because I'm 60 miles away, but I'll do it in my front yard. It just ain't going to be today. So be looking out for that video. I always keep my word about everything I say, and I'll do it. And I want to tell you, I appreciate you watching.